Uh, really good start. Uh, play with high pressure, good energy. Uh, first 15 minutes is, is really good. Uh, we lost the momentum a little bit between 15 and 25, but overall, we I think we did a really good first half. Uh, so we said in half time to keep going, uh, maybe try to press them uh, even more. Uh, I think we lost a little bit of energy in the middle uh, in the second half. Uh, and of course, it's the third game in eight days for us. And they have rest for one week. So I think that's what's the difference a little bit. We tried to make some changes in the middle to bring in, bring in uh, Alex and uh, Emina in the end, and also to play Julia Lester as a, as a central midfielder. Uh, we had our chances to win in the end of the game. Um, uh, I think we deserve three points today. We create good, uh, enough of chances, and I think we're a little bit unlucky on their goal. It's, I mean, it's, it's a touch. I think on Fox foot and change direction. In other case, there's no way that's going to be a goal. So, but they have been a little bit similar so far, the, more or less the whole season. I think that we deserve a little bit more than we get right now, but. Uh, uh, today, um, um, I think we, we're doing a better performance than we have uh, we did in the previous game against Seattle. Is there a different approach or like a slightly altered formation with three at the back? And, and how did you think that worked for you all? I think overall good. I think the, the defense, they didn't create that much chances. Uh, we gave away a little bit of the possession, but I can be fine with that. Um, because they had the ball the most of the time on their own pitch, uh, own side. Um, so that was fine. And like I said, I think we had, a, especially in the first half, a lot of little bit a longer ball in the channel to Davis. And uh, she did a good job up there. And in the end, Nadia had some, a couple of chances as well. Uh, so overall, a, a good performance, I would say. Yeah, I mean, we we can expect, uh, I mean, well quality from her. She's so good, so I know that she's disappointed. Even if she scored one goal, I know that she's disappointed because she wants to help us to win games, but that's life. And uh, we also need to be fair against her. She helped play, this was, I think, her second 90-minute games in, in more of like maybe one year or something like that. So we need to have that in our mind and, and she did good she was of course tired in the end but as a coach when you have a quality player like that you, you want to you want to keep her on the pitch still yeah 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 I, I think for the defense balance I think uh, maybe Freya and uh, and Howell is our like strongest central midfielder. So we were talking about, to, and I think we had a good control, but we, we lost the possession a little bit for a while, but I was okay with that. Um, but of course, after the game, we can also discuss if we next time need to do it even earlier. Yeah. Um. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I, we were so disappointed with the, with the start in previous game when we gave away any, the momentum where we gave away a goal and this kind of things. And uh, we understood in this game that we can't give away minutes. We, we, we I think we, we need to, we needed to win this game to have a chance to beat top six. Uh, we talked about it. We put the, all the eggs in the same basket today that we said let's go for it for and we did in the end of the game as well that we said uh, bring in Jess on the right side I said don't you don't need to think for the balance just go for it all the time uh, we had some crushes from that side and we bring in Amina and Alex like I said and uh, but it was not enough but we we talked a lot about to have a better start today, and we had. Uh, I know that Nadia helps a lot with her like you know leaderships. Uh, she will not accept a, a bad start again. 
So, yeah. So does uh, not getting the three points tonight change your approach to the rest of the year, or is it still full steam ahead? I mean, we, we need to grow as a team, as a group, still. Uh, if I think it's going to be difficult to beat top six, I need to be honest and say, yes, it's going to be difficult. I think we need to win it seven games left, and I think we need to win six of them. Uh, you never know. I mean, we, we talked about it. We think that Kansas, for example, they are a, a good team, but we don't think that they are much better than us, and they have been unbeaten in eight games. So that's something we talk about, that we, if we just can come over the little bit of the hill and start to win, we think there's going to be another one and another one and another one. But, of course, in this league, to win six or seven, it's, it's tough. Yeah. Uh, so how challenging will it be to prepare for next week, having played three games this week? Will they get an extra day off? Or yeah, we will have one extra day off, so it's going to be normal if we have one day off, but we're going to have two this time, so they, it's a recovery training tomorrow and then uh, Sunday, Monday off, yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's, uh, everything is uh, if it's a done deal there, but of course we're interested in her and she's a really good player. So if we sign her, then we're gonna have a really good player here.